Well, my hornies, uh, before I go on a 6L run, my final run, see what I can crank up, I have, to tell you, I have to tell you something about the frame. Basically, I screwed up a bit with the frame, apparently it was a bit too flexible. On a 4L, it was going all good, except the yaw issues, but a friend of mine warned me that it might be due to the flexibility of the frame. In the hands, it didn't feel much like or something, so I thought it will do, like my my weight saving stuff but apparently it didn't once the power what what's the power with the 6L it started oscillating badly and I was trying to stabilize it in the holding in the hands I can I could see visibly visibly tubes are slightly flexing also two two millimeter thickness um, carbon motor mounts they were oscillating badly as well so I turned down PADs to 1.8 roughly that was still like barely barely flyable and around 30% of throttle I crashed like dropped dropped it good I broke the canopy I don't have any PT anymore to mold another one so just has to do as it is uh, I doubled the motor mount here with fiberglass and there's a 8 mil carbon tube as well now it's now it's rock solid so as you can see my weight saving goes out the window aerodynamics goes out the window uh, and whatever I can crank it up uh, from this one it'll do and basically for my next build I will know what to do and what not to do not to screw up again <laughs> right so she's ready for 6L we're gonna go straight on to HQ 5.4s what gave me 1.4 kilos per motor and see what that will give me on a 6L battery I'll be using 1.55 uh, nanotex they are rated uh, 65 130 C roughly whoo scary stuff All right so I'll see you at the field okay more 6 cell test HQ 5.4 probs didn't do me well I could hear the motor screaming and getting a full RPMs but I still didn't get the trust that I wanted it was actually slower than a 4 cell All right let's start logging Right, so this is the five-inch bullnose props on 6L. Uh, on a bench test, they were giving me a bit overkill for ESCs and motors, but she looks like they're capable. We'll see. Found my copter scattered at the field uh, with bits and pieces, lost the cam somewhere. Anyway, uh, I have to stall my 6 cell testing further because simply this frame is not suited for it. It got to bad oscillations again at the full throttle and I and I bloody went down. So still at 163 kilometers an hour I have to settle with this record so far and at that speed it's still oh yeah. <laughs> So hopefully some of you are going to beat me next time and that will motivate me more to beat you again. Right, so, so much for now.